Hey everyone, this is Simmer Erin and I'm going to be covering Gamescom and the official reveal or some kind of teaser for the next Sims 4 game pack. I'm recording this just minutes before the stream. I do apologize if you get this video late, but I'm sure you have already heard the news. So right now I'm just introducing myself, saying hi, and if you're new here, definitely drop a comment and just let me know who you are. I would love to meet you. And so coming up, I'm going to be reacting to the reveal of this game pack, getting pretty nervous. So well into the stream, we finally got the release of the pack and it is Star Wars. All of you guys were right. I'm not going to lie, when I saw this, I literally just dropped something because I was so shocked. Maybe I should not have been shocked that it was Star Wars because, of course, all the theories were going towards that it was going to be a Star Wars pack. But I literally, when I saw this, I was like, are you, are you serious? I just, I never thought that The Sims would actually do a literal Star Wars pack. Now, I do kind of want to break down the trailer a bit for you, but honestly, I'm in shock. So I do hope you, uh... Just understand that this might not be the best video in the world, and I do want to do a fall video. I guess I was just thinking probably it's going to be a general sci-fi theme. There is no way that they're actually going to do a game pack all based on Star Wars. But sure enough, they're doing a game pack all based on Star Wars. Now, I want to say right off the bat, please do not attack each other in the community. I understand some of you guys are going to hate this, and some of you guys are going to love this. Let's go ahead though, and let's actually watch the trailer a bit more slowly. So this is the world right here, of course. It looks very beautiful, I guess, if that's the correct word for it. You obviously have all the costumes. It looks like we are gonna get some new occult types. And it also looks like there is gonna be some kind of gameplay where you can, I don't know if you can play as the stormtroopers or not. That would be really interesting really does look like there's going to be some kind of quest based i'm guessing that she's a main lead and i don't even know this is really giving me strangerville vibes honestly with the kind of lab thing going on you gotta apologize i gotta apologize guys i'm not a big star wars person so i don't know all the details by any means but it does look like to me like i said that there's going to be some kind of storyline so this of course is like the canteen area very well done in terms of decor just trying to get over how it looks like so i'm really wondering if all of those sims if that's just going to be kind of thin details skin details or are these really new occults what do you guys think now as far as i mean there's so much to break down this is just like a shocked reaction right now so please let me know if you want me to do a cast dive and also a build by mode dive i don't know what to say we're actually getting spacecraft before cars i'm literally laughing right now in my head i'm not trying to be disrespectful to anyone who wants this please don't say that i just i'm shocked so we did see that we are gonna get lifesavers we are gonna get guns um yeah this is this is really crazy i noticed the main lead again i really do think there's some kind of quest or storyline i guess that's what the scrolls were referring to I do notice the main lead, the hair looks very familiar. Some of the build by items almost look familiar to me, which sounds really crazy, but honestly, these are very interesting. I don't know how you would use them outside of this world, but it does definitely look like it fits into the world. I'm really curious. First of all, it comes out super soon. It comes out the 8th of September, guys. So that is super duper soon. I am probably going to go ahead and play through it slowly one more time. Again, I'm sorry if this is like my worst video ever. I just feel really shocked. So again, we do have the world and it is a gorgeous if you are into that. I really do think the details are excellent. I don't know about the gameplay. I'm wondering replayability. Is there going to be replayability? Is this going to be a quest again or is it going to be kind of more free gameplay? Again, with the lab, it really gives me those Strangerville vibes a lot. So that could be a good thing or bad thing, depending on what you think. I expect that this is going to be a pack that is going to be probably the most divisive pack that is 
well, not the most divisive, but one of the most divisive packs that has ever come to The Sims. And that doesn't mean it's not going to be a good pack. It just means there's going to be some uproar in the community. And so I do think that it looks like a lot of detail went into this. I'm really curious, though, how the star, the, the spacecraft, rather, is going to work in the lightsaber battles. The lightsaber battles, to me, really give me some Realm of Magic vibes. And some people have said that when they were speculating that it was going to be a Star Wars pack. And as far as just everything else, I'm overwhelmed. It looks like it comes with a lot of items. It does look like some of the stuff almost looks familiar, which is really weird to me. It definitely, definitely is a Star Wars pack through and through. It luckily, I personally think that it's good that they didn't put in the actual characters from Star Wars. You guys can let me know what you think in the comments below. Although maybe they did. We don't really know that yet. But I was really thinking that it was going to be a general space themed and I could see that have been, you know, something that was inspired by Bad 2, but it really feels like it literally is. So let me know what you think in the comments below. Please don't attack each other. I know it's going to get really dicey. Please let me know if you guys want me to do a follow up reaction. I'm literally shocked right now. I know I shouldn't be, but I, I cannot process this information. I promise. I will do some follow-up videos, but right now, I just need to go take a break, try to calm down, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.